Hi everybody! Tonight I will show you how to cast on with a f uh, by making a flat panel on your knitting machine. First you will cast on on the first black needle. Cast on that means you go one in the front, one in the back for the first row. There. I will keep four needle free. Very important to put your yarn under the big, <laughs> the red bump. I don't know how to call it. If you know, just put it in the common. Close the yarn feeder, and then I will go slowly. And the yarn that was under the red bump, just come back and close the knot to do the stitch. So. I will go like this and come back. Very important to have a, a loom hook because uh, when you get to your end, it's very important to lower the stitch to make sure that it's not dropping. See, you, you will go one bump over the stitch that you want to knit and then you come back. Have you seen? The black needle you go one more and you come back there you will go one more and then you come back always keep a close eye on your stitches to make sure that you don't drop any at the end need your hook there lower hit and then you're ready to continue. Make sure that it's, the yarn is at the right place. And then you come back. It's not a race, so don't go too fast. Flat panel uh, need very, very, <laughs> a lot of practice, not very, very. Oh, no, no. Maybe I'm too tired. So now, I will show you how to add some colors or switch yarn. Lower that with your hook. Go through over one and you come back. But now you cut the yarn and you will go with the gray yarn. Remove the beige one, put it in the middle. Put the gray one, close the yarn feeder, make sure that you put the yarn in front of the, the needle, in front, there, the beige one and the gray one in front of the needle and side by side to the beige one. And then you go slowly to make sure that your yarn is attached with the needle. You pull on it a little bit to secure it and you get to put your counter to zero to start making your rows. I took this part of a video from uh, a new project that I'm preparing right now. It will be a sweater. So if you practice this, you will be able to do the sweater when uh, I'm done with it. It's, it's a long project, so pass through one and then you come back. Yeah, a lot of people ask for a sweater, but they don't understand how much time consuming it is and a lot of money that I have to put for the yarn. But I will do it. There, pass through, push it down and come back. Very very important to check your both of the both of end to make sure that it no drop stitch. And you keep a little bit of tension on your finger. If you see my end on the yarn feeder, 
you could see that I holding the yarn just a little bit and I put the yarn in the top of the yarn feeder because I think it's I think I'm not sure but for me it's work it put just a little bit of tension if you put too much tension it won't work if you don't put enough it won't work either so you have to be careful and a lot of practice I'm working on this on an ex, extra large sweater for women or men. I'm not sure yet. It's not done. <laughs> I don't have any uh, body to try it on except mine. So I'm an extra large lady. So I will <laughs> I will put it extra large. It will fit me after. So I continue. this pass through one and you come back almost finished the video hope you enjoy it and hope you learn it because the flat panel is not easy you have to find the right yarn the if it's not if it's too thick it won't work if it's too uh, not stretchy enough it won't work so you have to try different yarn on your machine and for some reason <laughs> it's not you the problem it's not the yarn the problem it's the machine sometime i saw a uh, sandro a model model of a knitting machine the 22 needle the lady was not able to do the flat panel on it and she was able to do it on the big one so probably it was the machine so I hope it's not that uh, happened to you if you're not able to do it hope you find a way and I wish you a good week I hope you enjoyed the video see you next time ciao ciao next week Oh, it's not done. I thought it was done. It's not done. Oh, sorry. So next week I will have a new video. I don't know yet if it's gonna be a trick or tip or trick or or tip or it will be a, a pattern. I'm not sure, but be there next week and you will see it. Ciao, ciao.